We are excited about this story and we're back with the new normal while we're all trying to navigate how best to get through the hot summer days. Peter and I have found it helps to get by with our friends, but the first few months of the pandemic, we just weren't able to do that. Yeah, nice to work with one of your friends, of course. Recently, Kristen and I together with our families, we've sort of formed a pod, I think you could say, either at the word well, at the White House and when we hang out on the weekends. And that's why we decided to share some of our favorite parts of DC from Kristen and her husband John's favorite place to hike to the Old Town Farmer's Market that's a go-to for my family. So this is your Farmer's Market. This is our spot. This was our Saturday morning routine. We used to live so close to here with the girls. This place is such a special spot because this Old Town Farmer's Market is the longest continuously running farmer's market in the country since 1753. Wow. It's beautiful. Crazy? It's crazy, but it's so beautiful. And you can smell all the good food. I can help the next person. I also like that, like, in this era to, like, support the local places around yeah. here. You can drive from Virginia, from West Virginia, from Maryland, from Delaware. The produce comes from all over the place. How long have you been coming to the Old Town Farmer's Market? 15 years. Wow. 15 years. I'd like to get, uh, what, shallots, maybe? Why don't I get some kale? I'm blown away by how big it is and how many people there are. They used to have like 7,000 people here a day. Now they say it's wow. like 3,000 a day. Do you mind if we check out the bowls? I'm, I'm here at your service. This is a two-year process to make this bowl. What That's kind how, of tree? This is American black walnut. That's a big salad, lady. <laughs> How's it been to be back? Slow to start. My business won't recover probably for two years. Six for one, two for eleven. Have yeah. you guys been busy since you've been back to business? Oh yeah. We uh, brought like 18 bushels of corn and it's going by like 10 o'clock. Really? When we're doing the show in the morning, that's like the prime purchase time. We'll do a half dozen. Thank you very much. Let's go to Rock Creek Park. That's one of my favorite places. I'm in. This is Rock Creek Park. It was actually the biggest urban park in the country. John and I come here once a week and we go on a really long walk. We look at the trees, we look at the birds. There are more than 180 species of birds here, you guys. Nice. Do you guys know what sound a woodpecker makes? There's someone knocking on your door. More than 3,000 million gazillion. <laughs> That's exactly right. Yeah. The reason why we love this park, it's so historic also. Presidents used to come here. Teddy Roosevelt, Eleanor Roosevelt used to ride her horse here. Look how pretty, guys, and look at the pretty water. Emmy, you see fish? Maybe we'll jump in after lunch. What do you guys think? <laughs> you lead. <laughs> we're, we're washing eating. our hands, and then we're going to have lunch. Love oh. you guys. Yeah. That's for after yeah. lunch, then, right? Actually, yeah. it's going to be the first thing I even touch. What the heck? Oh, the cookies first. Let's Fine. raise a glass. To being together. The socially yeah, distanced yeah. gatherings with friends. Yes. Yay. Cheers to that. Cheers. Cheers. It was such a special day and so nice to spend time with you guys. And obviously, it's what people are doing right now, spending time with people they trust. My favorite part was when Ava said she was eating dessert first. <laughs> yeah, that's how we do it in our My house. kind of picnic. We're training them right. The Old Town Farmer's Market, of course, in Alexandria. That's my first stop after the show, Peaches. And fresh corn and the kale salad that crushes it. A little pecorino, a little roasted chopped almonds, a little lemon vinaigrette. We'll do that next time. We still have our peaches. They are delicious. It was so much fun. Yeah. Hope you guys can get outside and do that with friends and family today. We're back right after this.